Sort of talking around, I mean, the central issue is the services veterans are receiving for care they're seeking. And what we're driving at is increased evidence that it's not happening. Secret wait lists, the bonuses paid so people get things when the services aren't being rendered. I know you would acknowledge. Major, I'm not going to quibble with you about allegations about one office and, and uh, an allegation now about another. I would urge you to note how many Veterans Affairs offices there are around the country and uh, simply state that what is required in circumstances like this is uh, a clear-eyed, uh, focused investigation and review, the likes of which are underway now. Uh, and again, we will look at the Chairman's letter and uh, review it. Uh, I think we all share uh, concern extreme concern when it comes to making sure that our veterans are getting the care they deserve. Uh, and when they're not, and certainly when there's, if there's uh, inappropriate conduct involved in preventing them from getting care, the President and the Secretary will be the first to insist that action be taken. In general, though, Democratic Senator uh, John Tester today said on MSNBC that he thinks VA, the VA Department is doing a, quote, pretty darn good job. Do you think overall they're doing a pretty darn good job? I, well, Ed, uh, I'll, I'll deliver the sound bite you're looking for. I think the VA has, under Secretary Sinchecki, uh, aggressively focused on the need to provide better care to our veterans, aggressively attacked the uh, disability claims uh, backlog uh, that exists uh, and uh, was e expanded before it came down by 50 percent because of the decision to make sure that uh, those who had claims related to exposure to Agent Orange and those who had claims related to uh, post-traumatic uh, stress uh, disorder uh, were uh, prejudged as um, uh, likely to receive a disability because of those claims. And that was the right thing to do. It also put added stress on the system and created uh, an additional backlog, which the VA under Secretary Sunshaki has been aggressively addressing. Uh, one last topic. Uh, can you address this report by the